Hello everybody, Rel here, and today we'll be doing a brief overview of the multi-tool weapons in No Man's Sky. Which one gives you the most bang for your nanites? Let's find out. The multi-tool is a versatile piece of tech, and it shows when you look at the weaponry you can fit in it. From the straightforward bolt caster to the explosive plasma launcher, you have a lot of options. However, even with a max slot multi-tool, you'll only have room for three weapons, including their upgrades. As such, some are worth your nanites, while others you can skip. The bolt caster is your straightforward rapid-fire weapon, and it's likely the one you'll use for a while. It's good for taking down animals and regular sentinels, but lags behind in damage when you need to tear through armor on sentinel quads or walkers. It relies on projectile ammunition, so if you run out, you're out of luck. The Pulse Spitter is a similar rapid-fire weapon, except it fires three bolts at once. While it does more damage and shoots a bit faster, it eats through your ammo at three rounds per shot. If you need something to do heavy damage, there are better options. The Scatter Blaster is the shotgun variant, and it can tear through targets, but not at range. If you don't mind getting up close and personal, this weapon can deal a lot of damage very quickly, especially with upgrades. It also relies on projectile ammo, though, so be aware of your reserves. The Blaze Javelin is a laser weapon that can deal some serious damage, but the charge time is often prohibitive for taking on multiple targets. It's useful for getting into secure buildings if you don't have a plasma launcher and can one-shot smaller sentinels, but you'll have to refuel it mid-fight if you run out of charge. Don't bother with the Geology Cannon, as it explodes on contact with anything and with a large blast radius. You're more likely to kill yourself with this than practically anything else in the game. The Plasma Launcher, on the other hand, is the go-to grenade launcher for anything you need dead in a hurry. It's the weapon of choice for taking on Sentinel quads and walkers, and it can blast open secure facilities in no time flat. While the Plasma Launcher can also kill you, the blast radius is smaller than the Geology Cannon, so you're less likely to end up as a cloud of vaporized particles. Still, permadeath players beware. Ultimately, as long as you have a Plasma Launcher for taking on big threats, the rest of your arsenal can be up to personal taste. That said, the Scatter Blaster is recommended for General Mayhem, combined with either the Bolt Caster or Blaze Javelin for taking out targets at range. The Pulse Spitter chews through too much ammo, especially early on, and the Geology Cannon is useless. Thanks so much for watching, hit that like button, subscribe button, and notification bell to see more videos like this in the future. Next time we'll be looking at ship weapons, but if you have a topic you'd like to see covered in a future video, leave me a comment down below. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you next time.